Hello, Facebook, YouTube. It's that holiday that, you know, they, you know, celebrate time when they try to walk the street. It's my old neighborhood right here. My old neighborhood right there my, when I was little. I was little six, you know, I was six. It's my old neighborhood. I used to ride my bicycle around here. But that's not really the message that I really want to talk about. But I'm going to talk to you about the reality of understanding pain. Yes, pain. You know, people, pain is not supposed to, pain is supposed to be an alert. Emergency, emergency, something is affecting your body. I mean, people think pain is a bad thing. No, it's not a bad thing because it's alerting that harm is coming from an area on your body that you know you need treatment on and if you don't get that treatment done it, can, it your body can get worse and pain is supposed to be an alert but it ain't supposed to be something that you supposed to live with all your life I'm y'all know who I'm I'm looking at you yes I'm looking at you you know who I'm looking at you know what I'm talking about pain is not supposed to be this thing that is supposed to be pumping everywhere in your body each and every life but because of a life that a life in a way that you accept it to you know cause harm and negativity <laughs> oh, yeah negativity you know uh, kind of you know loves that you know pain and loves putting the pedal to the metal to pain you know there's there's little pain and there's extreme pain if y'all know what I'm talking about but you know pain is really serious it's a really serious supposed to be an alert system say help I need assistance or something to heal my pain that is going on in my body and we gotta we need to see it like that but we're not gonna see it like that you know when you know here's the thing about hurt you know hurt proceeds I mean when you are hurt pain shows up you know it's a proceed hurt and pain but the thing is, you know, um, what are we going to, the question is, the most important question is, what are we going to do about it? Are we going to treat it with, what, what are we going to treat it with? <laughs> oh, are we going to treat it with something based upon the earth? Or are we going to uh, do something based upon heaven or more likely natural or spiritual? Are we going to see the spiritual reasons why this is happening? Or are we going to just, you know, think this just a natural cause? <laughs> You'd be surprised how much diseases and sicknesses out there that uh, are not really natural causes. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that, you know, that are spiritual causes because a spirit proceeded something natural. You know what I'm saying? That is going on concerning a lot of things that, you know, people need to understand. But uh, if you think that, you know, you can heal your pain by doing things that will suffice it concerning what is of the, you know, world, <laughs> they, they try to suppress pain or try to, you know... Uh, uh, hide pain, you know, just take this and, you know, forget about, you know, that something still trying to produce energy, negative energy that is trying to build up that pain happens again, you know, cycle, you know, you know, and the thing is, you know, you're going against a cycle, you're not going against, you know, uh, 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 experience you're going against a cycle that is producing that is you know continually 
building and if it doesn't get resolved, it's going to keep on hurting. Yeah, pain is nothing to play with. <laughs> it's, it's, but it's supposed to be an indication of something is happening and I need to understand what's happening. And the thing is, look, Jesus Christ, huh, what a guy, awesome guy, took the paint on a cross with the understanding that something has to happen. Or if it doesn't happen, then things are not going to work life is not going to work out in planet earth something has to happen here if it doesn't happen a lot of people a human race can be damned but Jesus took the hurt and pain for a reason to bring life just as a woman you know you know bearing forth a child she's enduring pain for a purpose to proceed life is what pain should be only utilized for. It should not be utilized, you know what I'm saying, for the sake of just wanting to be hurt in the spirit, a cycle of hurt and pain, hurt and pain, hurt and pain. It's not supposed to be for a cycle. But like I said, it's supposed to be to alert us that something is happening within ours that needs treatment. And I hope and pray that it gets spiritual treatment instead of natural treatment then that because spiritual treatment will make it disappear natural will you know suffice the pain and the pain is coming back but hey y'all better respect pain because guess what when you're in pain you start wanting to spread that pain to everybody else yeah you you do things to hurt people to make people feel the pain that's inside you and now you're press spreading pain to other people and causing a side effect that is harming other people for something that, you know, really that may not been that legitimate. But guess what? When a person's experienced a cycle of hurt and pain, they will want to pass it on to other people for some darn parent reason. And that's what you got this crazy, chaotic world, you know, operating in confusion, conflict and chaos, Satan system that uh, Satan stealing and killing and destroying a lot of people's lives because of people don't know how to respond to pain the correct way and understand that, that pain is supposed to serve a purpose but not a major role but a minor role concerning life and not death. All right, that's the message. I hope you got the message and I hope you understand hurt. I mean, understand the uh, reality of pain and use pain for a purpose and not use pain for people to perish. All right, to God be the glory, Him forever, ever in Jesus' name. Amen.